Labels are a super flexible way of organizing Gmail. I personally, I couldn't do without them. I'm Chanel Greco from Saperis, and in this video, I'll give you some tips and ideas on how you can work with labels in Gmail. Here we're in Jane Examples Gmail, and on our left side, we see we already have two labels which we've created. We have our digital business strategy, and if we hover over it, these three dots appear, which always is an indication that these are more options or that you can further manipulate this um, item here. We'll click on these three dots and we now have the possibility, let's say, to add a sub-label. So we already have a label concerning this uh, digital business strategy and we want to add a sub-label to that. So we do that and we give it the name of, I don't know, let's say budget. Okay, we create that. And we also have the possibility to change the color of this label. Let's go ahead and give it a color of kind of like purple, or if we're feeling super fancy, we also can say add custom color um, and go ahead and choose this green, whatever. So whatever you feel comfortable with. Actually, I think, let me see, add custom color. That was the text color, actually. Um, I wanted the label and so there you go apply that okay that's better that's what we wanted to do now what we see is that we also let's click that open we we have some more labels here already oh there you go this is what i wanted to show you can create new labels here using this button let's say test label and we can also choose to nest a label under, let's say, current project. We'll do that. So then it should pop up here. Okay, very good. So far, so good. What we also can do is we can manage the system labels. So the system labels that Google already created for us, we can go, let's say, and hide them if we wanted to. We're now here in the settings under labels and what we first see are the system labels. So we could theoretically, if we want it, we could hide the start label. Here it is. If I click on hide, it disappears. You can show it, or let's say we don't need the snooze. So we'll hide that from our um, user interface. What we cannot do with system labels is for example, nest custom labels to it. So we can either choose to show or hide system labels, but we can't um, altogether delete them or edit them in any other way. And this user interface is also a possibility to create new labels. So we have more than one place where we can go ahead and create new labels. We can say test one and can edit that from here if you want to. Um, final, and then it gets changed over here. So we have more than one place to actually go ahead and edit or create or altogether remove um, labels. Let's say uh, I don't need this anymore. So I just say, okay, remove label. There you go. It's gone. It's that easy.